Evening Prayer on Saturday the 22nd of August Blessed are you, O God. You sustain us in desert places. I will make with them a covenant of peace and banish wild animals from the land so that they may live in the wild and sleep in the woods securely. Blessed are you, O God. You sustain us in desert places. Some verses from Psalm 6. Turn, O God, and deliver me. Save me for your mercy's sake. For in death no one remembers you, and who will give you thanks in the grave? I grow weary because of my groaning. Every night I drench my bed and flood my couch with tears. My eyes are wasted with grief and worn away because of all my enemies. Depart from me, all evildoers, for God has heard the sound of my weeping. You, O God, have heard my supplication. You accept my prayer. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be for ever. Amen. Let us pray. Remember, O God, your compassion and love, for they are from everlasting. Amen. A reading from the Gospel of Mark. In those days, Jesus came from Nazareth of Galilee and was baptised by John in the Jordan. And just as he was coming up out of the water, he saw the heavens torn apart and the Spirit descending like a dove on him. And a voice came from heaven, You are my Son, the Beloved. With you I am well pleased. And the Spirit immediately drove him out into the wilderness for forty days, tempted by Satan. And he was with the wild beasts, and the angels waited on him. Let us pray. Living God, Protect all who find themselves in hard times. Those who face an unknown future. Those tempted to abandon hope. All who struggle with loss of faith. We ask for your blessing particularly on Chris, Kevin, Joanne, and any others on our hearts this evening. Some words of Mother Julian of Norwich. God did not say, you will not be tempted, you will not be sorely troubled, you will not be distressed. But God said, you will not be overcome. Amen. Let us pray with confidence as our Saviour has taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us all evermore. Amen.